um, it's me, Layla. Um, so this is the fuck. This is the third day um, that I've been in Taiwan. Let me tell you, amazing. The lighting is a little messed up, but I've definitely gotten darker, as you can see. Um, I'm loving it so far. The language barrier is a little bit annoying. However, right now we have students coming around with us everywhere from the university that is able to translate for us. But if you signal a lot with your hands, they get it. Um, so yeah, the nights are amazing like the best temperature you'll ever find I swear you are not dying like you and I'm very sensitive to heat it's amazing um what else so a couple of funny stories um I'm gonna tell you about when we went shopping for um stuff for our room like bedding and whatever not so I am chill mostly with these two people uh Terri Ann is one of them and Jonathan is the other so we're just chilling, and then one minute, I'm cool, I'm fine. Next minute, Jonathan's like screwing his face. I'm like, what's the issue? And he's like, why are these people taking videos of us? I was like, what? Turn my head. Have some lady, like in the background, with like her phone. Employee, mind you. Not just a rando, an employee. Okay, so I'm like, whatever. Alright, what did I do? I'm bright, so I got my phone. Went up to her and I was like... Expecting to get cussed out, which I didn't. Or at least an angry, like, reaction. She's like, oh! <laughs> I was like, oh my god. So I just started laughing because you know what? Whatever, I don't mind. I'm like, why am I even getting mad? It's not like they're being rude. It's just that they haven't seen people that are this dark before. So I left. I left and she came and she wanted to get a pic. So we posed up for her really nice, like with the fingers. And that was one story that was quite interesting. But let me tell you some stuff that has also been happening, just like chilling. So I'm walking down the street. We're all walking together, obviously. We're going everywhere, trying every food, trying to get deals. The deals are crazy, by the way. Some things are more expensive than they should be, considering it's Taiwan, but most things are much cheaper. So we're walking down the street and people are staring at me. So I'm just doing the wave and they're all like, they're really nice. They receive you very well over here. They aren't rude, but I'm not saying there aren't any rude people. But everyone that I have come into contact with is so sweet. They wave, they try to talk to you and much as as much English as they can otherwise they start speaking in Chinese and like whatever not it's it's cool but they come up to me and they touch my skin and they're like mm -hmm. I'm like yeah I'm black like you know what I mean but whatever so they touch my skin they touch my hair like I have like curly hair like not now obviously but they come up to me and they're like oh mm -hmm. like can touch and I can touch I'm like yeah like if you need to you know what it's fine. I don't care. I'm just very hospitable. They look up to me and like, well, I'm not, but whatever. They look up to me and they're like, you're so tall. You're so tall. I'm, like, tall. I'm like, yeah, I'm tall. But it's fun. I mean, I the most expensive meal I paid for here was $3.96. Everything else has been like a dollar, two dollars. And like, the flavors you would think they because they use a lot of veggies and you know they don't really use a lot of spice as we do especially as westerners because especially in, Can in canada because we have such a multicultural and diverse food scene we use so much di uh, types of different uh spices the food isn't as bland as i thought i mean sometimes i should add some like hot chili but it's, it's so delicious and it's fresh and it's amazing i had some sushi last night took an hour like an hour but you know it was it was good it was not bad i'm actually gonna try the mcd's over here just to like um compare but apart from that there's pizza hut and stuff but they're all like literally the same almost the same price as like canada if you compare the taiwanese dollar now the taiwanese dollar is 30 about 30 of their dollars to our one dollar so i just paid 780 dollars Taiwanese like Taiwanese dollars for my entire uniform if you translate that translate sorry my bad 
if you um, switch that over, I'll do that right now, 780. Okay, like, come on, you know, like, 780. Ready? 26 bucks. Can we even buy a shirt for 26 bucks in Canada? No. So that was amazing. Um, I'm gonna go downtown soon to like find a bunch of knives for my knife kit. It's amazing. I have some pictures that I'll be posting up of different sites and different how the town looks. Last night, um, one of the one of the girls took us downtown to try and get like really discounted phones. They are less expensive than the ones in Canada, but just I'm looking for a better deal because I've totally messed up my BlackBerry. By the way, they do not use Blackberries over here don't like the sim cards don't even fit in a blackberry like i don't even understand that but all i use is iphones and samsung's and if they're not going to use those smartphones they use like anything but blackberry which is sad so i can't bbm my friend unless i like anyway i'm getting off topic but the downtown scene is amazing we're actually gonna i'm in kaohsiung right now kaohsiung which is in the south but i'm going to be heading up to the north to taipei soon to see the light festival so i'll have a lot of pictures of those too but yeah this is my first vlog video ever so if it's boring sorry but you know i'm having so much fun so far like some of the people i'm with like that we came with are annoying the fuck out of me and i want to punch them but what can you do <sighs> um so thank you for watching this first video of mine and i hope that you keep watching i We'll try and promise that the videos will be more interesting from now. And yeah. Oh, also, I don't know if you can see, but this is my room. Right now. Hold on, I just did like Okay. So that's my like little chest, and that's my arm there. Yeah. And that's my bed and ugh, whatever. Anyway, there's like um a couch right there. I have a couch like a chaise kind of. And I have it comes with a TV. Sorry guys. So, yeah, thank you for watching. I'll be posting a lot of pics. Um, you can give me feedback if you can on how this video is. And I look forward to making some more for you guys. Alright, I miss everybody at home. And thanks. Okay, bye.